Hi there, this is Love Johar. Thank you so much for watching this channel and thank you so much for tuning into this video. Many of you wanted to know about AWS security audit. How to perform AWS security audit, how to perform public cloud audit. So this video is about that only. I will help you to understand what are the important key elements that you should check when you are doing AWS security audit. So what is AWS Security Audit, first of all? Let us try to understand that. AWS Security Audit is nothing but a systematic review of your AWS environment. In order to identify any security vulnerabilities and misconfigurations that might be present in your AWS environment. So you should be clear about this. So how it will help you, how the Security Audit will help you uh, on the AWS Cloud so this will help you to ensure that your AWS environment is compliant with any of the industry standards and regulations that your environment needs to comply with. Secondly, you can actually identify and remediate any security risks before they can be exploited by the attackers in your cloud environment. And thirdly, most importantly, this will improve your overall security posture on the cloud as well as it will reduce your attack surface. So this is why you conduct a security audit. Now, the best way to conduct will, of course, depend upon the size and complexity of your environment, your budget, and your level of security expertise that you have in-house. But the regardless of method you choose, it is important to conduct regular security audits periodically so that your environment is secure. Now, what are the key elements that I wanted to tell you about? There are some key areas in AWS security audit that you should con consider in your environment. Number one is IAM. Now, what is IAM? IAM is the foundation of AWS security. So it is important to ensure that your IAM users, identity and access management uh, users, roles and permissions are configured securely. It is very important you check the IOM, IAM roles and permissions periodically. Okay, whether the permissions that have been assigned to your users, to your groups, whether that has been assigned appropriately or not. The second thing that you should consider for is networking, whether your AWS network is segmented properly so that you do not have any security breaches. You should create security groups and network ACLs, access control lists, to control your network access to all your resources. This is very important. Third thing is storage. Your AWS storage should be encrypted. You should always use encrypted storage so that your storage cannot be accessed by any unauthorized uh, users. You should also use access control list for people who can access your storage data. That is also important. After that, you have compute. Your compute, your AWS compute resources should be configured with security best practices, such as you know strong passwords, multi-factor authentication. All this should be embedded in the compute section also, so you can use security groups for that to control access to all your uh, VM instances in the uh, cloud, to all your uh, you know, different compute resources that you have, to all the servers, etc., or hosted on the cloud. After that, last but uh, not the least is very important logging and monitoring. You should use CloudTrail and CloudWatch. These are two AWS services that are very important in order to log any or all activity that you are doing in your AWS environment. How this will help you? This will help you in order to identify any suspicious activity and investigate any of the security incidents that might have been present in your uh, AWS environment. So if you follow these key best practices that I have provided in this video, and I can assure you then by conducting regular AWS security audits, you will actually be able to protect uh, your data and your applications from any unauthorized access. So thank you so much for tuning into this video. If you have any follow-up questions, if you have any uh, you know, uh, follow-up comments on this video, feel free to uh, add in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.